Hey, what's up guys? Kyle with Kyle Lean Gains Bodybuilding. Uh, today I got my chest, triceps, and delt workout for you guys on tape. I know everyone's been asking for that. Everyone wants to see the bench press action. Uh, right here we got, that's my brother spotting me. For, this is my second time using the belt on the bench. Um, I actually like it. Uh, it makes me feel like I get a little more stabilization in my uh, push. So That is 220 right there. Going for sets of 8. Uh, I believe I. this is my second set, and I do get 8 on this one. Um, still trying to get a little bit better, better leg drive. I got a good arch in there, but I don't feel like I get much leg drive. See, my legs don't really move too much. So I'm going to try working on that. Uh, Oh, I do wear wrist wraps also. Um, I messed up my wrist a long time ago, and it's never been right, so the wrist wraps just give me a little more stability. That was a hard-ass eight right there. <laughs> um, yeah, there's my belt. It's popping it right off. It's, I like it a lot. Uh, let's see. Got some incline dumbbell flies here. Um, these, you get a really good stretch with these, um, doing 45 pounds per hand here. Uh, just bring them down to parallel, or, yeah, parallel to the floor. You'll see here, right there. And then just back up and get a good squeeze at the top. Um, yeah, these, these will make your chest get a really good pump, guys, so... I definitely recommend doing these. Uh, let's see. I think I'm going for yeah, I'm going for around 10 to 15. I get 13 on this set. I actually got two sets recorded of this for you guys. Uh, let's see what else. Um, oh, I took uh, Mr. Hyde stacked with Hemoball today. And I hadn't, I haven't taken a uh, pre-workout in almost a week because I, I had that deload, so I decided to take a week off of my pre-workouts. Man, that hide is freaking strong. I, I was taking craze before that, which I'll have a review up for that pretty soon. But that hide, man, I, I think I overdid it a little bit. One scoop was a little too much for me today. I was a little, uh, little. A little shaky, <laughs> um, but I still had a really good workout. I hit all my reps, added some reps, and added some weight to some things. So it was a good day in general. That's my brother right there, my twin. Um, just doing a little spot in here. I do go to failure on this day, guys. Um, my hypertrophy days, I go to failure on my last set. So. That way you're getting some of the good um, fatigue factor of the failure, you know. He's just back there just to give me a little assistance on the last one because I do actually want to not be able to get that last rep up by myself. I think I get 12 here. I like to keep my hands pretty wide on these feel it better in the chest. I feel like if you get uh, your hands closer, it's more like a press. See, there he comes in to help me out with that last one. And that's my last rep for that. You like that? Uh, Legends of Aesthetics tank top? Those things are really nice. If you guys don't have one, I definitely recommend getting one. And get the, uh, the Team Hollywood gear that's coming out. I think it's supposed to be on sale today on uh, Barthel Fitness on his uh, site. We'll definitely look out for that too. Here's just some pec deck. Um, with these, I don't like going past parallel. I like to keep a little before. And then you get a good squeeze in the middle. A little bit of uh, seated shoulder press. These are 65s. I think I get seven yep seven on this set um, make sure you go all the way down 
right about there. Parallel with your face, somewhere on there. Just in line with your face, you know. And this is not a set to failure. I mean, it was pretty damn close, but I could have squeezed out one more. There's my brother's hand. That's him in the background. He's doing a little bit of warm-up action. Uh, this is the triple drop set of lateral raises. If you guys want to feel your shoulders be on fire, and I'm talking like I can barely move my arms when I'm done with this, do these. So those are 30s in each, 30 per hand there, and I you do 10 of each. So I do 10 of these. Then I, once I'm done with these, I'm going to immediately put the weight down and grab the 20s. So I'll step back, grab the 20s, bang on another 10. <laughs> I'm serious. Your shoulders will be on fire from doing these guys. <laughs> if you guys want to critique any of my form, if you think I need to adjust anything, feel free to leave a comment in the description or in the box below. Um, I'd like to know, obviously, I mean, on these ones I do get a little swing in them. This is my last set, I think. Uh, you'd be surprised how heavy 15 pounds can feel. That's what I'm doing next here. Doing another 10 reps with uh, 15 per hand. And, I mean, I, I, I gotta put some body English into these things to get them up. <laughs> that guy's in my shot. Get on my shot. He just wants to be on YouTube. Uh, <laughs> let's see. So yeah, I get 10 more of those. A couple more exercises here. I do uh, some cable push downs and some inclined skull crushers. Um, that's about that. With these, with these cable push downs that I'm about to do, um, that girl back there definitely squats. She has a nice... Nice backside. She's a trainer there. Alright, uh, lifetime. Anyways. <laughs> With these push downs, you want to make sure you keep your uh, your upper arm pretty still and just use just your triceps to push down. That's what I'm doing here. Getting uh, 13 of these, and then I move on to some skull inclined skull crushers. Um, about that. So yeah, that's the gist of my workout there guys. Um, be sure to comment below, like the video, subscribe if you haven't already subscribed. Uh, I will have other videos up for you soon. Here's some skull crushers to finish it off. And I will let my brother narrate the rest of this for you.